pia nilaendanga mavueni kwa pasta Ezekiel na nilienda ibada ya New Life Holy Communion Siku mficha hata saa hii kama wananiona wananiona wananijua kabisa ukweli au kumficha Siku mficha ali, 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 wakati alikuwa ananipima kwa room akaniza nataka utuambie apo particular zake immunizations zenye alipata ndio hizi zote oh, immunizations zenye ali eh zile chronic illnesses zenye alipimwa sasa ini ke Kenyatta National Hospital Medical Medicare Center medical examination form yake sasa sasa kitazi mudachi eh eh mudachi men age 29 Najua wanaume wajui hiyo lakini wamama wanajua. I know men don't know that but women are aware. Anasema huyo ni mbwa huyo achana naye. Anafuata chochote. They will say that is a dog he follows anything. Maana mbwa 20 ni wanafuata mwanamke ngapi? Because 20 dogs will follow one man dog. Mwanaume mwenye kima, any wise man upamba mkewe na utembea na yeye popote aendapo. Who make his wife be Bega makofi mwanaume hata kama wewe she goes. <laughs> Today I know I have a case. Asante brother. Thank you brother. Thank you. Amani ya chap. Oh do I leave it at that? Unajua wengine sahihi hawafanyi kazi kwa ofisi, anaangalia TV. I know some people in offices now they are not working. They are wondering how is where did they come from? But it opens our eyes. What is this? Testimony. Is it a testimony? Give him the microphone. Let's hear the testimony. So that I may continue with my testimony with men. Sikudanganyi nitafundisha men mpaka ndoa zetu zipate maana. I will teach men until our marriages get meaning. Nitafundisha wamama mpaka ndoa zetu ziwe na ladha. I will teach our women so that our marriages have Nitafundisha familia mpaka divorce ihame kwa nchi yetu. I will teach the family until divorce leaves our families. Karibu. Bwana asifiwe kanisa. Amen. Pastor mimi nilikuja hapa nikiwa na magonjwa mengi sana nilikuja kama nasumbukana nilikuwa nimetembea mahospitali mingi daktari ananipima magonjwa magonjwa yaonekani yani nimeenda hospitali on monday yenye nilikuwa nikitibiwa nikiangaliwa na daktari kule Kenyatta ulikuwa unatibiwa Kenyatta eh nilikuwa natibiwa Kenyatta langata wewe ndio ulipona ugonjwa gani ile HIV I came here when I had so many diseases when the doctors could run the test they could not see anything pastor wacha nikwambie hii madhabao imenitendea miujiza kabisa hata siwezi taka nisikie mtu akiongea vibaya this altar has done so many good things to me i would not even want to hear anybody speaking negative about this church microphone pastor wacha nikwambie ukweli nilikuja hapa last year nilianza kuja hapa last year nilikuwa na magonjwa mengi kabisa nilikuwa nilikuwa nimeambiwa siwezi kula gedheri siwezi kula maragwe gedheri gedheri maragwe maragwe mananasi nyama sijui nikaambiwa nilikuwa na kula nyama ya red nilikuwa nimeambiwa nisikule yani karibu kila kitu pasta i was here i was told to eat that i should not eat so many food nilikuwa nimebaki shindano moja mlikuwa umebaki shindano hivi kama shindano hata watoto walikuwa wananitoroka pasta mlikuwa umekonda kwa nishinda aki ukweli wa Mungu sidanganyi nilikuwa nimekonda kabisa hata niko mimi sawa yani nilikuwa nime sawa sawa hata hata vile nimeenda Kenyatta on Monday madaktari wameniambia Patrick tunataka utuambie ukweli wanakujua wananijua Kenyatta wananijua vizuri kabisa hata wameniona wame, wame Monday nikienda huko juu niliona wacha niende kuconfirm nidhibitisha kama nimepona ama juu ile wakati si kwa nimeenda nilikuwa nimeambiwa tu na mdomo so nikasema wacha kwanza ndio nienda sasa nipimwe kabisa ndio nikuje na ile evidence yenye inadhibitisha hata roho yangu itulie vile nimeenda nikapimwa pale Kenyatta daktari akanita akaniambia Patrick 
ni wewe tumekuwa tukikutibu hii miaka yote tangu kitu hata uko kwa, kwa faili zetu uko kwa register nakwambia pasta nimepimwa kila ugonjwa nikafanywa kila tesi zote na daktari yeye mwenyewe ndo ameandika hapa mpaka akaniambia nataka tuambie ulienda wapi nikamwambia sita kuficha daktari nikamwambia nilaendanga mavueni kwa pasta Ezekiel na nilienda ibada ya new life holy communion siku mficha hata sahi kama wananiona wananiona wananijua kabisa ukweli au kumficha siku mficha ali, 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 wakati alikuwa ananipima kwa room akaniza nataka utuambie apo particular zake immunization zenye alipata ndio hizi zote oh, immunization zenye ali eh zile chronic illnesses zenye alipimwa sasa ini ke Kenyatta National Hospital Medical Medicare Center medical examination form yake sasa sasa kitazi mudachi eh mudachi mel age 29 Wait, 77 umeni shinda na kilo ndugu wacha pasta nilikuanga na kilo ilikuwa inafika 55 55 55 hata mimi mwenyewe nimepima kilo hivi daktari akanikashangaa nikashangaa pasta sasa nakwambia chronic 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 illnesses examination immunization si zile watoto upewa A, alipata chanjo zote, chanjo zote yeah. lakini sasa chronic illnesses epilepsy hana diabetes hana asthma hana hypertension hana heart disease hana allergy hana renal disease hana peptic ulcers disease what ulcers disease hana others hana others hana na kwambia pasta We, nani mwili wake hauna ugonjwa for the first time mwili mzima ina ugonjwa shout hallelujah amen pasta wacha nikwambie unajua tangu nikiwa mtoto mdogo mama aliniambia nimeisi kumsumbua na magonjwa mimi nimeisi tu kwa madawa tu kwa madawa tangu nikiwa mtoto mdogo hata zingine mama alikuwa ananitumania wakaendelea wakaendelea Oh, eh, part 3 current medication are you ah. con- current medication are you con- any medication part C examination general examination oh, current medication hakuna eh hana are you con- medication examination, examination. eh uh-huh. ana pala hajavimba hana jaundice blood pressure ilikuwa 119.75 which is normal pulse rate ilikuwa 74 which is normal Respiratory that heart rate ilikuwa 14 of which is normal. Others hana not applicable. Then cyst then systemic examination wakaanza na respiratory system. Chest bilaterally iko clear. Then cardiovascular system zote ziko normal. S1 S2 zilisikika. Then, then cardiovascular ikaonekana abdomen iko soft and intact hakuna kitu iko na shida nervous system gcs iko 15 over 15 of which is of which is normal then musculoskeletal system hizo sasa si kuanzia kichwa mpaka chini hiyo tumia mic kwa tokea kichwa mpaka chini eh kwa hiyo like kwa spine of venye yake ina function iko intact eh laboratory examination sasa wakaenda wakaangalia hb hemoglobin level ilikuwa 13.3 of which is normal then random blood sugar ilikuwa 4.3 of which is normal urine analysis wakatafuta wakaangalia protein in urine hakukua then wakaangalia sugar hakukua in, in urine others hakukua then malaria parasites akaangaliwa hana VDLR negative you need civilis 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 hana eh then imaging where necessary angefanywa x-ray sababu hizi vitu zote ziko normal conclusion conclusion wakaandika he is fit he is fit amesa call fit fit not fit 
not fit. Oh, so he is fit. He is fit. I'm a circle the fit. The man is fit. Yes. Imeandikwa Kenyatta National Hospital 31st July 2023. Imestampiwa na director. Pastor Badu. Badu. You know when Jesus raises the power of healing, we are supposed to be happy and the devil should get angry and get away from our lives. Then Pastor HIV status yake alikuja nayo nikamwambia Venye wameandika CD4 county yake iko undetectable. Sande kamwambia rudi kwa daktari advice. Eh? Daktari niambia kuhusu HIV aliniambia iko undetectable, iko undetectable. Virusi haviwezi vikasomeka. Kwa hivyo hazionekani. Hazionekani. Lakini arudi kwa daktari ya no, the doctor will advise. What did he say? So daktari aliniambia hivi huko tu Kenyatta bado aliniambia sasa kumeza dawa itakuwa uamuzi wangu aidhi nimeze vile nitajisaidi sasa lakini niko sawa sasa naomba wafanye kitu kingine i pray that they may do one more thing waende watoe damu ya hapa let them extract blood from here ndio hiyo wamesema it is undetectable hiyo ni cd4 viral rod waende watoe damu zingine they should take other bottles and run all the tests and then bring me a report na yesu anasema fit 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 na yesu anasema iko sawa iko sawa iko sawa iko sawa Another testimony. Nilikuja hapa kwa ibada ya mesa ya Bwana. Hiyo wakati tu last year tu wakati nimeanza kukuja tu hapa. Ndoa yangu ilikuwa inanisumbua kabisa. Tulikuwa tunasumbuana na bibi. Hatulikuwa tunaelewana. Kila wakati ilikuwa tu ni vita tu, vita tu, visirani. Hata nilikuwa nashindwa kwani nini nini kinaendelea? Lakini tangu tukuje hapa na yeye kwa ibada ya mesa ya Bwana Pasta na kuambia tunapendana. Ananiambia ati huyu ameshtuka. It happened last year when I came Pastor, here for the Pasta ananiambia hata kama una pesa sikuachi. Hata kupe... kama una pesa na kupenda sana Unaishi sana. Unaishi wapi? Tunaishi Gedorai 45. Nairobi. Eh, Nairobi. Nairobi mtu akupende bila pesa. Ah, umependwa ndugu yangu. Who love you Nairobi without money? Nani natoka Nairobi hapa? Usiinue mkono na. Na nimetoa kule kwenye mamangu ametoka Sara, huko Makueni. Eh, eh. Huko ndo nimetoa huko. Ananiambia ananiambia sikuachi. Na kukua hivyo. Ilikuanga tu ni vita, 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 vita. Tunakorofiana, yani ku Tuko nasumbuana sana pasta. Sasa hizi uki, ukienda kwa nyumba yetu saa hii pasta. Kupitia kwa hii madhabao ili amani yenye yuko hata saa ananiona ananipenda. Paka tunabebana hivi juu pasta. We were always fighting in the house we could not get along with one another. Nisaidie na microphone yangu. Pasta moja. We love each other so much. Nimekuletea mjukuu. Ah, nime, nime, niko na mjukuu. Lakini bila hajaweza kufika saa hii atakunangojea kwanza apate nguvu kidogo. Mjuku? Eh. Hey. Amepata mtoto? Eh. Hey. Niko na mtoto pasta. Sasa wako na si, na si, 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 si ngeza kupata mtoto. Au kwa unapata watoto? Si ngeza kupata mtoto pasta. Sinakwambia nilikuwa nimekonda sina nguvu. Hizo nguvu za kiume hazikukua. Sasa ziko. 
Isaiah nakwambia ziko pastor. Eh, hey, nakwambia ile gari. <laughs> I was impotent, I could not get a child, but today things have changed. I am blessed and I can now have children. Now I have a, a baby. Nikihubiri sitapitia uko acha nipite. Bora isa sifi. Praise the Lord. Watu Mungu leo hii si Yesu afagie tu magonjwa yetu na shida zetu zote aondoe. May the Lord take away our problems our diseases completely from our lives. Akupe ushuhuda kama huyo ndugu. Huyo ndugu sasa anaishi hajui shida zinapitia anga wapi. Shida huwa zinapita na huko. Hata shida sio majirani yake. And give you a testimony like that brother today he does not even know what problem is. Ana jirani anaitwa shida shida zimepitia na kule magonjwa yamepitia na kule vita vimepitia na kule umasikini zimepitia na kule. He doesn't know what Mungu akubariki leo kwa jina la Yesu. May God bless you today in Jesus name. Sasa ameniharibia nilikuwa na ubiri juu ya nini? Now what has, was I preaching about? Nani? Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Praise the Lord. Mtu wa Mungu maisha ni mazuri. Mungu hakutuumba tutezeke. Life is good. God did not create us to suffer. Imagine Mungu akituumba hata mito aliyotupatia ilikuwa na perfume. Can you imagine even when God created us he gave us rivers that had perfume? Mawe iliyokuwa inapatikana huko ilikuwa ya dhahabu dhahabu. The rocks you could find there were golden. Alafu shetani akaja na mbinu zake. And then suddenly the devil came with his, his ways. Ndoa yako ipone leo kwa jina la Yesu. May your mind...